Hey guys, what's going on? And uh, welcome back to another video. Um, today's video is going to be kind of like another discussion video. Um, I'm really sorry, to be honest, for making these types of videos. Um, a lot of it just comes down to me not really having any games to play or me having any games that um, I'm really interested in. And, you know, as I've talked about in the past, um, if there is a game that I enjoy a lot, I'll probably do a playthrough of it and then post it on the channel. Um, but apart from those new releases, really, there's no game that I really feel like investing a bunch of time into and making content for. Um, the next game that would be like that would be probably Cyberpunk 2077 when that comes out this year. Uh, apart from that, if the new Avengers game comes out this year, I'll be recording that as well. Um, and also streaming it and by the way um, if you guys are interested in what I've been up to um, basically I've just been super super busy with college and stuff like that and I really haven't had too much time to record um, I have been streaming quite a bit uh, I've been streaming Thursday nights to Sunday nights um, because that's when my college schedule kind of permits me to because I usually do my homework on the weekends and then I'll stream uh, Thursday night to Sunday night uh, for a couple hours. Usually I try to get in about three hours a night at least. Uh, so that way I can still keep the affiliate um, requirement. But yeah, if you guys are interested in kind of following me and seeing what I'm doing, that would probably be the best place to do so. Uh, my Twitch is twitch.tv slash coltonhq. Uh, as I probably won't be posting much content on YouTube from here until maybe the summer or whenever those games come out. So when those games do come out, um, like I said, I will be sh trying to record them. Uh, I will be basically streaming them when they come out like I did with Spider-Man and um, God of War. When they come out, I will be streaming them. But what I'm going to do from now on is because I have a storage drive on my computer now, I have a terabyte storage drive, which should be plenty enough to uh, store both footage. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use it for a storage drive. And then when I'm streaming, if there's something that I want to record, like a new game, uh, I can record that for you guys and keep the same quality uh, rather than me trying to uh, upload it from Twitch. Because that's what I've been doing for um, majority of the games that I've been playing. and. I can tell uh, that the quality drops off quite a bit, so I will not be doing that uh, much anymore when it comes to the YouTube content, um, unless it's a game that like, I don't know, I didn't really feel like recording. Like uh, for example, when I played the playthrough of Shadow Warrior, that was kind of a game that I just didn't really feel like recording, it was kind of a game that I just spur of the moment wanted to play, and then I just uploaded the VODs, stuff like that will be still happening um, I might try to look for a way to maybe figure out how to keep the quality for stream recordings but I think it's because the of the encoder that I use I use uh, the Nvidia encoder so yeah but um, besides that that's uh, basically my plan for me for YouTube from now on uh, if I find a game that I want to record then I will record it for you guys uh, on a side note the Vitas GG stuff that I talked to you guys about before, uh, unfortunately, is no longer happening. Um, we were playing this season of Open. Uh, however, the roster that we ended up going with, I made a roster with the guy that I met online. Um, it kind of just didn't work out. I don't really know how to explain it. Like, it's not something, like, there wasn't... There wasn't a clear answer on why it wouldn't didn't work out. Uh, we started out very very slow in the season. I believe we started out. I want to say it was like two and five, and then we started winning a couple more games, and then basically everyone just kind of gave up. Uh, one of them went and left to another team, and then uh, another guy quit, and then by that time, which was only a couple days ago uh, roster was already locked so we can't get more players um, and I mean that's kind of on us or me and the guy that tried to make the team because we waited so long we basically didn't have the roster until right before the season started but it wasn't an individual skill level thing um, for some reason we just weren't clicking when we were trying to play 
Uh, we tried many different ways to try to practice. We tried just scrimming, uh, which didn't work. We tried, you know, pugging before matches and stuff like that. It kind of helped. Um, and then kind of, uh, you know, the guy went and left to the other team, so he couldn't practice at all. So it just kind of became, okay, well, when everyone's on, just go ahead and start playing the match. So, yeah, um, unfortunately, I don't really know what the outlook is for me for Counter-Strike right now. Um, I am still playing with the off-season team, Catalyst. Um, so we might be playing the next season this fall. I'm not too sure. I have a lot of passion for the game, but you know, every time I've tried to make a roster, it never really worked out. And I would say that this season, I've played better than I probably ever have. So I don't know if it's just a matter of me trying to do too much and me trying to run like an entire team by myself. Um, because basically all the shit that happened was kind of over. I went on vacation for a weekend, uh, four hours away. And I got back and then basically everyone was like, okay, well I'm done. And I was like, oh, okay. Cause I didn't see their messages until I got back. Um, so yeah, I kind of just got kind of fucked in that sense, um, but it's really no big deal. I kind of knew it was going to happen eventually. If uh, Even if we did play the, through the entire season, I kind of knew that these guys weren't going to stick around. Um, and, you know, I've with the ECA subscription and stuff like that, me being a college student, I kind of can't keep dumping money into ESEA and uh, just Counter-Strike in general to try and like uh, keep playing because I got to be conscious of where my money's going uh, because I, I got to try to save as much as I can while I'm going to college. And uh, you know, if this whole Catalyst stuff doesn't work out, um, I'm not too sure. But you know, my drive for playing the game uh, definitely hasn't been there uh, as of recent. And I think it's just because of the whole Vita stuff that went down. And um, I kind of just want to take a little bit of a break and maybe hop back into it. I still don't know if I'm going to uh, be recording content for Counter-Strike. That's still up in the air. There's really not too much that I can record unless it's just like matchmaking or something like that. Uh, which I'm really not too interested in like there's plenty of people that do matchmaking content and you can definitely go watch them um, But yeah, so Basically on that note like I was recording the matches I was uh, streaming them and recording them and I was going to post them I have probably like I want to say 10 to 12 VODs of matches that I was going to upload, but because it was abandoned, um, I still have them on my computer. Please let me know down in the comments section below if you would like me to upload them. They're not great. We lost majority of the matches, but the ones that we did win, you could definitely tell that there was something there, but we just couldn't consistently get that product. Um, but yeah, I still have the, the footage for right now and I'll kind of leave it up to you guys if you want me to upload it or not. Um, but I basically wasn't going to upload it because we couldn't finish a season. Like there's still, I think two or three more matches that we still have to play before the season's over. And we just can't play because we only have three players. Um, so yeah, uh, if you do see me streaming, I will be playing with Kata though. Uh, majority of the time, I don't know if I'm going to still stream it or not. I will let you guys know on the stream. Um, but yeah, for content, probably from here on out, um, unless you get a notification for me posting something, look for me on Twitch more than likely. I'm um, trying to hit affiliate on there. I have all the requirements except the average viewers, which is honestly very difficult to keep or to get uh, to raise that. So yeah, just kind of stay posted. Um, I will let you guys know what content I will be putting up on my Twitch. Uh, if there's some sort of game that I enjoy playing, like maybe the new uh, Riot uh, FPS game that they're working on, 
who knows? I could be posting highlights on that or some other game that I end up really getting into. Um, WoW is not really a thing anymore for me anymore. Uh, I just said that twice. WoW is not really a game for me anymore. I spent better part of a year on it, and uh, I'll probably play it again when Shadowlands come out comes out. But the current content patches and stuff, I'm really just not interested in. So I haven't been posting content for that or even streaming it. Um, really the only games that I have been streaming is like, especially recently, Arma 3. Uh, I do still enjoy that game. Uh, and now that I have enough storage space to keep it on my computer for an uh, extended period of time, it makes it um, a lot easier to play. So I've been playing Exile with a buddy on there. It's just uh, PvE Exile. So we've just been kind of chilling out, having fun. And... Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to kind of keep my options open right now because my schedule has kind of freed up quite a bit, especially with me, me not having the Vetus rosters anymore. So maybe this summer um, I might rework on making a roster. I'm not too sure. Uh, the whole making a roster thing hasn't really worked out for me uh, in the past because, again, I'm the only one trying to run it. Uh, I've tried to get help from people, but they kind of just fade off and then don't do anything. So, yeah, I'm not too sure, but I appreciate your guys' time. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely give it a like. Definitely subscribe for videos. Again, I don't know when they'll be coming out, but they will be. Uh, and yeah, definitely follow my Twitch. I'll put it on the video somewhere here. Uh, Twitch.tv slash ColtonHQ. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. I appreciate you guys.